Yes, tonight I'm Meredith Hagler. A man is dead on the city's east side after his car slammed into a parked semi truck left on the side of the road. This happened near the intersection of 30th and Massachusetts Avenue. The driver of the red car was the only person involved in the accident. On their way to respond to the crash, the Indianapolis Fire Department had an engine flip over just a couple hundred yards down the road, sending four firefighters to the hospital for serious but non-life-threatening injuries. Over the past 30 days, this stretch of road at 30th and Mass Ave has seen two fatalities and an emergency vehicle severely damaged. Tonight, our Griffin Gonzalez spoke to a neighbor that is concerned for a dangerous road that lies a mere feet from his doorstep. I've been worried about a vehicle running into my, my trailer because that corner allows vehicles to not see that they have to turn and it drives drive straight into the, the, the embankment. John Galeta has lived in his trailer just a mere feet from 30th Street for the past seven years. As he walks alongside the road, every dent or scrape represents another example of reckless driving. He right slammed here. off of that guardrail there. He drove down the side of this guardrail all the way down the concrete until, he, uh, until his front rim disintegrated and his front end of his truck hit the actual top part of the guardrail there, otherwise it probably broke through it. On Saturday, a car crash claimed a man's life. Just minutes later, as Indianapolis Fire was responding, one of their engines flipped over while trying to cross a median, sending four firefighters to the hospital with serious but non-life-threatening injuries. John saw it all and captured it on his home security system. Is that the scariest accident you've seen here? Yes. In my eye. Because I watched it from right there. Moving pretty quick. You can see from the video, the first truck was moving pretty fast. I mean, he's creating dust as he went. Yeah. And uh, it don't take much, but that was, that was drastic. Saturday's accident marks the second death in under 30 days on 30th and Mass Ave. IMPD is still investigating the cause of the accident, but for now, they're asking all drivers to use caution behind the wheel. As if we drive responsibly, um, um, slow down, we can usually avoid crashes like this. Right now, this guardrail is the only thing protecting John's home from speeding vehicles, but he feels it's not enough. And uh, as far as replacing it, you can put a brick wall here. They probably go through the brick wall because they travel down here at high rates of speed. In the meantime, he hopes people ease their foot off the gas. Slow down, slow down, because you got a lot of dangerous curves here, and there's a lot of danger involved. In Indianapolis, Griffin Gonzalez, WRTV. Police tell WRTV that they are still investigating what led to both crashes on the city's east side.